That's right. Check it out. The governor, Governor Mary Fallon, not only inside a tank, but right at the top, driving over a car in northwest Oklahoma City. What was left of a car there? Now, this was all part of the opening of a new business. And here she was, Brian Stronsky was there and talked to the governor about driving a tank and shooting one high powered gun. Yeah, Morgan, check this thing out. This is actually the tank that the governor rode in. And over here, this is what's left of the car. Now, all of this was to kick off Wilshire Guns opening weekend. And what do you see what the governor did once she got inside? Here's something you don't see every day. Oklahoma Governor Mary Fallon boarding a tank, ready to roll right over this doomed Nissan. Fallon's famous ride and this smashed up sacrifice are part of Wilshire Gunn's grand opening weekend. The tank actually went up on one side and I knew we were tilted up pretty good and then when we started crushing it, I could hear the metal crushing underneath. The 40,000 square foot facility is state of the art and the first gun range in Oklahoma to offer bullets and booze. It's, it's a great new addition to Oklahoma City. It's creating jobs. As eager customers browse the selection for the first time, the governor had something else planned. One and a half seconds is all it took to blast a hundred rounds from the barrel of an M134 Gatling gun. That went fast. Very fast. Wow. Look at all those bullets. A dramatic close to day one of Wilshire Gun's three day celebration. Okay, on three. One, Brian Schlonsky. Two, three. KOCO 5 News.